Hi there, traders and investors. Today is Tuesday, January 23. I'm glad to greet you online and share a regular market review prepared for InstaForex. Gold is making a downward correction. I've detected a few nice bearish targets which could be hit soon after the nearest news. Let's discuss my trading ideas. First, we should look up in the economic calendar. High impact news will be available from Wednesday. We will get to know PMIs for the US. On Thursday, the ECB will announce its policy decision. The press conference will follow the policy meeting. Later, new home sales in the US will be released during the American session. The first instrument to discuss is gold as usual. The price has gyrated recently and left a few curious targets. The metal is now trading at the levels where we can pan long positions. Today, Asian traders tried to break the high of January 19, but they failed to hit it. There's another bullish target left in January this year. It's still untouched. The price made a swing low in the Asian session. If you're ready to risk your money, you may set a stop loss 500 beeps down. So you could earn at least 1,500 beeps. With a more ambitious target, you might, uh, you might earn 4,500 beeps. You test your luck at these two targets. If something goes wrong, just activate your stop loss. I suggest we enter the market during the ongoing downward correction with a tight stop loss. Here's my bullish trading plan. The euro dollar pair has been heading for the downward target that we have tried to hunt for a few times. Yesterday, I sold the instrument aiming to update the low of the month. The price made five attempts to approach this target. Finally, I decided to close positions at a break even. I opened short positions from a swing high. I waited until this level was tested. Then, I closed my short positions. The instrument fell overnight. When I woke up today, the price had rebounded. What is going on now? The green back is now advancing across the board. This will enable a breakout of the one-month low. Perhaps it will happen not right away but after an upward retracement. I have no idea how to earn from this. I have found a swing low. In this case, a stop loss will be more than a take profit. Not a good profit loss ratio. Let's return to the gold chart. I want to apply the Fibonacci agree to two bullish sections. The AUD USD pair is trading lower. I remind you about lots of good market entry points downward. We could go long at the lows, aiming to take profit at 0 0.69. I'm showing you this trading idea on the 4 hour time frame. I see a speculator profit loss ratio. We may earn big money. The pound sterling is losing ground today. There's a mild ascending channel. I assume traders will go long from the lower border aiming to reach the upper border. I'm not going to trade now because I don't see nice swing points and targets. The USD CAD pair still offers buying opportunities. It's now standing at a swing high on the 4 hour time frame. Again, I haven't found interesting targets for large bets. Hence, Let's stay away from the market for a while. The same is true about the dollar yen pair. The odds are for its further growth. That's all I wanted to tell you today. Good luck in trading. See you online later.